And it is crazy, I'll tell you, some of the same areas that were hit so hard by Ida are now getting torrential rainfall. Here is the storm Nicholas made landfall just after midnight last night, Matagorda, Texas, and it has proceeded to move very slowly northward, now northeastward, moving east northeast at six miles per hour. Peak winds just barely tropical storm strength, so the wind's not a big factor with the storm anymore. The rain, though, is, and it's a major problem, and here is why. Let me show you the latest forecast track. There's the storm now as we go forward in time all the way to Thursday afternoon. That's it. It only moves from here to there. Central Louisiana near Baton Rouge hardly moving at all, and that means many of the same areas will keep getting the rain. Now the rain area is not super solid right now, but nonetheless, it'll keep coming back outside here. We have some clouds overhead. Get used to it. It's going to be like this for several days. I think on the WVTM 13 live Doppler, a few patches of rain over the east. Another big patch coming in from the southwest. That'll be the rain we get for tomorrow. In the meantime, over the northeast, there'll be some showers and thunderstorms this evening. Locally, heavy downpours with some of these on the east side of Gadsden right now, as you can see, eastern Etowah County getting some heavy rain in Hoax Bluff and Ball Play, too. Down the road, things will be changing. For the time being, we're going to need the umbrella.